so I haven't filmed in a while. I filmed in, I think, December, maybe? My Ed Sheeran video? Um, if you guys follow my October videos with Ruben Hawkins, I think day 22, I want to say, that's probably wrong, was the Anna's Chase video, uh, costume. Um, if you guys don't know who Anna Chase is, she's a character from a book series called Percy Jackson series, written by Rick Riordan. There are two movies, there's Percy Jackson and the Lightning Thief, Percy Jackson and the Sea of Monsters was the second one. Today we're going to talk about the first book, The Lightning Thief. I have not read this in a while, so I don't really remember exactly what happens, but I remember most of it. Um, this is the first book of the Percy Jackson series. This is Percy right here. He's the son of Poseidon, and he's blamed for stealing Zeus's massive bolt, which is the bolt that controls lightning, because that's what Zeus is, the god of lightning. And they all think Percy's like, well, no one, Percy doesn't know that he's a demigod yet. No one knows except for his mom. As that's when Grover and turns over the camp half blood, which is a camp that he goes to for demigods like him. Um, and uh, Percy is ADHD and dyslexic. Now, I'm dyslexic and ADD, which is pretty the same thing, except ADHD is attention deficit hyperactive disorder. I have attention deficit disorder, which means I just can't pay attention to anything. Um, so I understand Percy's struggle with reading. Um, like having trouble comprehending stuff, but what's cool is he cannot read English, but he can read Greek. So when he reads, his brain is hardwired for ancient Greek, not English. So that explains the ADHD, the dyslexia. The ADHD is his bowel reflexes because he can't stay still, he has to be moving around. Um, so that's basically that. Um, this book, though, is probably. Not my favorite book in the series, but it's one of my one of the books I've really enjoyed reading. It's probably number four on my list out of the five books. There's five of them. Um, in this book, we get into Percy going on a field trip, and he gets kicked out of school. Um, and uh, he has ten days to return the Master Bolt to Zeus. Now he goes on this wild goose chase, meets... Ares, the god of war, meets his dad, meets Zeus, and um, he's placed in the Hermes cabin with Luke. Now Luke is a troubled child. He is just overrun with wanting to have power or be strong and cool, and like he wants people to like him, but he's very hard to like. Now. He does trick Percy into thinking they're friends, but they're not really friends. They Percy just thinks they are, but they're really not. Um, and uh, there's one part in this book that I really like. And it was when Annabeth is talking to Percy about her dad. Now, Annabeth is Percy's friend. She's a blonde, she's really cute. kind of knows what to do in strad in things situations that happen to her now her dad does not like her he resents athena resents annabeth has a new human wife and two humans living with bobby and matthew now percy says why if your dad was in hell like would you do? And she replies with, I would leave him there to rot. Percy is shocked by this. And he asks her why, and she says, because he hates me, he hates, he wishes I was never around, he wants me to live in Olympus with my mom, but I can't because I'm not a god. I have to be a god to be in Olympus. And he says, well, have you tried going back home? And she says, I do, but halfway through, I just end up leaving again. I have been in camp since I was seven years old. And this kind of just, it's hard for me to see a parent treating their daughter like that, because I mean, I'm not a parent, but I worked at daycare and all my kids were great with, had great relationships with their parents and I have a great relationship with my parents and my family and family is important. And that's kind of what this book is trying to 
show with the way family is, they're always there. These are family-oriented books, and the movies kind of cover that too. But Percy's dad's not there. He all, all he has is his mom, and Annabeth doesn't have anybody. But um, she tells her story how she wants to be an architect, and how her dad doesn't really respect her. The book's really good. The movie is a little different than the book is, and I like that because they kind of made it more kid-friendly, I guess. And the second movie has a lot more action in it, but this is, this is a good book. Um, if you are one of my younger viewers and you wanted a book to read, I highly recommend the Percy Jackson series. Um, it's my favorite. But um, I'm going to read the back of the book to you guys and leave you guys with that. Um says, Percy Jackson is about to be kicked out of a, another boy's school again. And that's the least of his, pro of his troubles. Lately, mythology monsters and the gods of Mount Olympus seem to be walking straight out of the pages of Percy's Greek mythology textbook and into his life. And the worst, he's angered a few of them. Zeus's master bolt has been stolen and Percy is a prime suspect. Now Percy and his friends have just 10 days to find the find and return Zeus's stolen property and bring peace and to a warring Mount Olympus. But to succeed on his quest, Percy will have to do more than catch the true thief. He must come to terms with the father with his father who abandoned saw the riddle of the oracle, which warns him of betrayal by a friend, and unravel a treachery more powerful than the gods themselves. Now, if you caught the last part, it said, betrayed by a friend. Spoiler alert, Luke stole the bolt, and he framed Percy for it. Because Luke wants power. He wants to overthrow the gods like they did with Cronus. That's Luke. But, um, yeah, I'm going to leave you with that. Um, if you want me to do a book, a video where I read the book to you guys, I will definitely do that. I will definitely read it again. Um, I am going to be doing more book review videos like this one. Um, and I do have some signing videos in the works. So if you guys like this video, up and subscribe down below leave me a comment like this video share with your friends share with your family share with your dog share with your cat whoever you have your fish it doesn't matter to me um but yes i can do i can read this book to you guys if you like but leave me a comment if you want that and i will be doing sea of monsters later this week and i will have more signing videos which i have not done one yet but i will be doing signing videos so, yes, like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.